any SharePoint on-premise deployment, proper planning for data and storage management is essential for a successful SharePoint implementation. Effective IT and operations leaders help achieve data usage goals by providing effective storage management. Many admins implement remote blob storage for storage optimization. SharePoint stores content into SQL databases as unstructured blob data. Microsoft allows admins to externalize blobs onto alternate storage, which improves performance and increases cost savings compared to SQL. AvPoint's great solutions like DocAv Storage Manager and Archiver take advantage of remote blob storage APIs provided by Microsoft that externalize content based on criteria such as content size, content modified dates, and even version number to ensure that active content can remain on SQL while inactive content is moved onto cheaper storage. In this video, I'll show you how by using our latest version of the AvPoint Discovery tool for SharePoint to see how much data you can potentially externalize and how much you can save. The AvPoint Discovery tool requires minimal installation and configuration to get started. Once installation is complete, select Content Discovery to get started. Here, you can select the scope in which you would like to generate a report for. The tree will list all web applications and site collections that reside in the SharePoint farm. Today, we'll be generating a report for the whole farm. Next, we'll select the Storage Optimization Report option for the type of discovery the tool will perform. Here, we simply have to enter in a SQL Server instance and database name in which we will store the report data. After validating the entered credentials, we can select Generate to start the discovery. Now that the discovery job is complete, let's generate a report. Here we simply enter in the same database credentials from the Content Discovery Wizard. Make sure to select Storage Optimization Report, and now we'll be entering in criteria for externalization rules similar to our DocApp Storage Manager product. We're going to externalize all content over 5 kilobytes and store them in the Blob Storage 1 device. Then we'll go one step further and externalize any stale content that hasn't been modified in 30 days to the Blob Storage 2 device. Once you're done configuring these rules, you can finally hit Next to generate the report. Here you can see the results of our discovery. We have this pie graph showing how much content will remain in SQL and how much content will be externalized to blob storage devices 1 and 2. Next, let's try to calculate how much we can save in costs. To start, you simply need to enter in the cost for storing content. For this demo, we're going to say that storing content on SQL costs $100 per gig per month. Then, Blob Storage 1, which could be file share storage, costs $10 per gig a month. And finally, for Blob Storage 2, this might be cloud storage, which costs $1 per gig per month. Once you click on Calculate, you can see what your costs are before and after externalization. Today, we can save up to 89% in storage costs by externalizing content by using any of our DocAv storage optimization products. Thanks for watching. You can download and use the discovery tool for free by visiting www.avpoint.com. Thank you.